Hello and welcome to another video. Today I'll be showing you how to make UK breaks in the style of Benton, mainly inspired by his tracks Brian and Going Down. The project file, samples and presets are available for a small contribution in the description and please do like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. If you like this style I've got a few different breakbeat packs in the description and feel free to suggest other artists you'd like me to cover in the comments. Our BPM is 130 and we're in the key of F Phrygian dominant which is a harmonic minor scale starting on the seventh degree. This is the kick. You might recognize this from the think break as it has the classic vocal shout. I've boosted the sub with an EQ. Then we have the breaks group. This is made up of the Think Break, Aim and Snare, Noise here. As Benton uses noise to back his snares in Brian with this almost acting like a dirty snare reverb. And some Aim and Ghosts. Here the snares are layered. As are the ghost notes from both breaks as well. On the group we have some saturation. Having all these layers makes the drums sound thick and present. If I mute each one at a time you can hear what I mean. Then we have the high drums, which have all been panned individually. All these elements come from the same break beats as the samples in the breaks group. So we've got two versions of the Think Tambourine and a crash from the Amen Break. And this means everything has the same aesthetic and therefore gels together. If you've seen any of my other breakbeat videos, you might have seen me layering with electronic samples, but here the classic break samples seem to work well on their own. This approach was inspired by Brian, where Benton seems to use multiple instances of the Think Break and the Think Tambourine, but be careful to make sure everything is in phase when doing this. I've applied this MPC groove to all the audio, and MIDI in the drums group, except for the kick. And on the group, we have saturation, drum bus, and EQ, plus reverb via send A, which is this basement preset. Next, we have a respace, which has been split into two layers. This is the sub. We have a sine wave taken down by two octaves with its unison at seven. In the effects, there's distortion and compression. On the channel, we have a mono utility, more compression. And an EQ because the other bass is providing the higher frequencies, which is why I've deactivated the mid and high band. This is the top bass, which as you can see is playing the same bass line as the sub. Uh, uh, 
Oscillator A is almost identical to the sub. However, FM from B is turned on and turned up. Oscillator B is a sine wave with its unison at seven and its level taken down. So we just get the effect of the FM. We have a low pass filter with drive and in the effects, we have distortion and an EQ boosting the low mids. On the channel, there's a utility reducing the width of the sound and an EQ cutting the low or bass frequencies. On the group, we have an EQ plus reverb applied via Sende. Next, we have the bass effects. Here we have a sine wave taken down by two octaves with this kick shaped amp envelope. There's a low pass filter with drive and distortion in the effects. Whilst LFO1 on envelope mode is modulating the pitch of the patch, which is why it sounds like and basically is an 808. However, I'm using it as ambience. If I deactivate the inserts, you can hear what I mean. So we just have some EQ and echo here. And reverb is applied via send A. Next, we have the two sirens. This first siren is made in serum. And we have a square wave with its unison at three plus some distortion in the effects. There's pitch modulation here too, which is ramping up quickly and then back down. On the channel, we have narrowing utility, saturator and a filter. I gave an almost identical preset away with my special request video. So check that out if you like. The traveling scratch is a reverse sample from the free classic jungle sample pack, which I'll link in the description. The London vocal is also from this pack. On the sirens group, we have drum bus, EQ, echo, and reverb applied via send A. Finally, we have the vocals. I found the first vocal on Freesound and I'll link it in the description. Both channels have echoes and there's lots of feedback on the echo for the female vocal since Benton does something similar in going down. With the London vocal, I've used EQ to make it feel more distant. And also to cut some low frequencies too. On the group, there's drum bus and EQ plus reverb via send A. That's the video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one.